The thought of Israelis and Palestinians spending another summer in this terrible conflict, uh, you know, such a large number of Israeli soldiers was killed in this conflict, and of course the terrible uh, toll on Palestinians. If this is going to repeat itself, then we need to figure out ways to make the authorities change certain um, decisions that were taken about the choice of targets, about the choice of weapons, etc. On a political level, I think, I say the majority of the government, certainly the current emerging <laughs> government, um, think and have stated very clearly that they completely discount our motivations. They think um, they're negative. Of course, I dispute that entirely. I okay. think the uh, Betelim is committed to this place of the society, uh, to improving mm -hmm. the record of our government. And certainly, I mean, we have very, very serious criticism of Israeli government policy and a whole range of our issues. But this criticism comes from the desire to improve this, um, this place. The first thing we try to do is try to make sure that our reports are written, phrased, published in a way that make them, uh, I wouldn't say immune because I don't think that's possible, but, but we, that we do it in a way that uh, combats utilizing them purely for Israel bashing. Yeah. We wouldn't give interviews and wouldn't cooperate with media, um, you know, requests if we thought that the purpose of the media request wasn't to look at real, you know, for, uh, out of a real commitment for to human bashing. rights, yeah. but just for Israel right. bashing. So I, th I think, by the way, I. I um, you know, before I came here, I, I didn't know what to expect. I, uh, mm -hmm. I did some research online, um, and uh, I have to say, I, um, after having our conversation, I'm, I'm, um, I'm surprised by how uh, sincere and, and and open this conversation was. And um, you know, I, I, uh, I think, I don't know, it might not be your intention to do so, but I think you're playing. Uh, a great role in, in, in Israel's Hasbara without even trying. Um, I always say, by the way, I always explain, you know, that the funny thing or the paradox is that in some cases, some Israelis, probably many Israelis, um, are like, ah, they didn't, well, there's no B'Tselem in Palestinian society, there's no B'Tselem elsewhere, which is disputable. I mean, you know, there are self-critical mm -hmm. organizations mm -hmm. throughout the world. but. One of the things we say is like number one, okay, so you're admitting that there is a role for B'Tselem, but the other the other <laughs> point That's in a sense is yeah. that actually the fact that this society has an organisation that can be critical of the government and do it, you know, with facing a lot of challenges and attacks and certainly you know a lot of smear uh, smear attacks and. Um, being unpopular. However, we still can operate. I can say what I want. We can say what we think is right. Um, is it's a, it's a, a blessing. A, yeah. It's not only a blessing. It's a it's a testament to Israeli democracy and um, True. the Israeli. In some cases, the Israeli government actually uses that. I mean, the Israeli foreign ministry actually made statements in various international forums about the thriving NGO human rights culture that Israel mm -hmm. has, which again, I yeah. am very happy that that's the case. So, so